No, I love it. I mean, like it's it's a it's a drug being around him twenty four seven, and it's always go go go, passion, 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 intensity, intensity, intensity. You see why he's the best defensive mind in, in football. You know, just his mindset and just how intentional he is and how he teaches. You know, this man like it, it's not just boom, boom, boom. It's teaching to to the to to the. Uh, minute detail of everything we're talking about on the football field. There's a reason. Or what's the weakness of the defense? You know, why are we doing this? All right, down the distance, why do we need a line like this? Just understanding the picture and how aggressively you teach it and having the mindset of a defense, of a call, is what I love being around. Like in, in BV, you know, Coach Venables is just a tremendous dude, tremendous person. And, uh, you know, once again, you talk about leader, leading from the front, you know, not from the back, leading by example. He's that guy for all of us. So, uh, you know, I'm, I'm beyond excited to be around him and, you know, being, I guess the only guy who's never worked with him on the defense, but always been a good friend, you know, being with him has just been amazing for me. That was a really good question. <laughs> it was good, man. Uh, to me, that was probably one of the most explosive offenses I've seen. You know, it's, it was Baker, but it was Baker plus, you know, Hollywood and, and Mark Andrews and CD and, uh, you know, the whole entire team was, you know, elite to say the least. Um, you know, they ran the ball for a lot of yards that game as well, too. And uh, just having that mindset, you know, obviously with an Anderson as a running back and, and how good he was and, and uh, just how good the whole entire team was as elite. But Baker's leadership is what really drove him. And we knew, you know, the biggest thing is we, if we could slow down Baker uh, and, and the way his tempo and his mindset was, we knew eventually it could, you know, we could get him. But it was, it was a tough game and, and uh, they put up a lot of yards and Baker is Baker. So he's elite. Yeah, it was, it was weird being on this side. I'm happy being on this side, but uh it was uh, it was energy, you know. I, I think it's one of the biggest rivalries in football, and I'm not talking about college. I'm talking about any sport, <laughs> and uh, in general. But it was it was awesome. Uh, obviously, uh, you know, a lot of big plays and guys playing aggressive and physical and talking and the energy and you know that's I think that's one of the reasons people get addicted to football and like it's a drug. It's supposed games like that and rivalries like that. So uh, you know. As the, the conference is going to, you know, it just means more. I guess that game just means more, too. So. Yeah, I think you always want to recruit to, to your what foundation you want as a program, right? And uh, one thing, seeing the way, you know, Coach V's really established it here, you know, you recruit, you know, your champions, you also recruit your problems. So it's a two-way street in recruiting. And the guys are we've been pushing on and focused on and really going towards, we want to make sure their mindset and mentality and disposition fits with our culture. Because when you're playing OU, you're not, you know, not fighting a team, you're facing a culture. You know, it's a, it's a culture you're going against in everything we do. So, you know, we don't want to weaken that culture or bring people who don't fit with us. And guys who do, we can keep building and climbing and, and create what uh, the man coach Vinny loves. And that's what we want here in this program. For more information, you can visit TulsaWorld.com.